If you have been paying attention to coffee trends, you may wonder about the differences between a drip vs a siphon coffee maker. Siphon coffee makers are also called vacuum brewers, and they require a short process with precise variables. On the other hand, the best coffee maker using the drip method requires little effort but sometimes sacrifices flavor. You may notice several differences between the two styles of coffee, including the method of preparation, flavor, and ease of use. The difference between drip and siphon coffee makers. Because of their increasing popularity, siphon devices have re-entered the market as a significant player. For some, they surpass standard coffee makers. However, many still use their regular coffee makers every day because they are so convenient. A siphon coffee brewer differs from a drip model in a wide range of ways, including its coffee brewing method, taste, ease of use, and control over your cup of coffee. To learn more about different types of coffee, watch video on an espresso machine vs a coffee maker. Brewing method. Vacuum coffee pots work by heating water in the lower chamber called the carafe. As the heat agitates the water molecules, the liquid becomes a vapor that drifts up to the top chamber or the coffee hopper. Then, once enough time has passed for the heat and pressure exposure to extract the flavor of the coffee, the barista turns off the heat. This process causes the water to return to liquid and pass through the paper or cloth filter. The resulting liquid is the coffee you drink. On the other hand, Drip coffee machines heat water from their water reservoir to brew coffee. The water then gets poured over the ground coffee beans and filter, causing the extracted liquid to drip down where the coffee pot catches it. Ease of use and control. Drip coffee makers provide an easy to use option for your morning cup. The machine does all the work for you, except grinding and measuring your beans and loading the filter. Some coffee products with a higher cost even provide these functions. Meanwhile, the siphon brewer calls for significantly greater effort on the part of coffee enthusiasts or the coffee shop. Not only do you have to measure the water, water temperature, and coffee grounds, but you also have to turn the heat on until it vaporizes and then lowers the temperature. Once the precise time has passed of 1 minute and 10 seconds, you turn the heat off. This brewing method gives you greater control over your cups of coffee. Flavor A vacuum siphon brewer creates a full flavor and full-bodied flavor in each brew. However, you should still adjust the brewing process to fit your coffee taste. Keep in mind that fresh grinds, grind size, and brewing length all affect your quality coffee. Drip brew coffee varies greatly in taste based on the roast used and the grind size. However, many baristas and experts believe that drip coffee has a weaker flavor overall. Additionally, your coffee maker is especially susceptible to watery and under-extracted flavors when using a coarser grind. For finer grinds, you may find your coffee is bitter and over-extracted. We are going to end this video right away. If you have any query or information to share, please leave a comment. Thanks for watching.